Yeah, yes, once again, it's the sports edition of the Dr. Archo. First, to start the show, a message or comment from one of Dr. Art's loved and beloved viewers. Hey, Dr. Art, I'm so near you. A video of my latest painting. Painting Halloween's. Can't wait to hear your quotes. Well, um, uh, Ned, thank you for the message. I'm sorry that I never uh, got back to you sooner than I uh, anticipated. Um, man, it's been about, uh, boy, uh, about a month. My God, it's, it's crazy, you know? Uh, I've said this before and I'll say it again. Uh, you know, I'm kind of old and losing my mind, and uh, so uh, bear with me, you know, yeah. Um, time gets away from me. My, uh, my days aren't as organized as it once were. It's been a long time since I've made a video, and uh, I said you were the next one, and I am a man of my word. And uh, I want to critique some of your work there, Annette. Uh, first, because I don't like to dwell on the negative, I'm going to get a little negative criticism out of the way. The Yorkie? Well, the Yorkie sucks. It's, uh, I don't like the Yorkie. I don't like dogs. It reminds me of a greasy little hairball. But, um,. But that's the only negative thing I can really say. Um, Honeymoon is a, a pretty nice little piece. Uh, it's got some nice textural qualities about it. I think that uh, this piece is, um, all in all, nicely done. Um, the carousel pieces are, uh, the carousel pieces are also very nice. Um, those, I would assume, are, are fairly marketable. People would uh, enjoy owning one of these pieces, I assume. And uh, I myself uh, enjoy the details and the um, fine quality overall within the work. It's, uh, it's good. Good, good stuff. There were a couple questions that you had posed in a, um, with your sister in another video. Um, Audrey, the uh, Annette and Audrey show, or whatever it is, the twin, the double mint twin uh, menage a trois, as I like to think of it. Two hot mamas and a dirty old man. <laughs> Yeah, that'd be, haha, <laughs> that'd be a good one, you know? A dirty old man and two hot twins, one on each side in the pool. Yeah, Dr. Art can see himself getting in that, you know. I'll ride that seahorse, I'll tell you what, uh, you'll, you'll see what free will is really about, you know? Um, anyway, back on the topic. Um, you asked a little bit about the art that I do. Well, I am not an artist. I've said it before, I'll say it again. I am not an artist. I am a art critic. I do a little dabbling. But nothing I would ever show. I, uh, I am more a scholar than I am a doer. I don't make art. Um, Although, there is some artistic tantra tricks that I could teach you two ladies. I'll uh, tell you one thing, you know. 
Uh, that's a, that's a whole art form of its own. But painting? Nope. Not for public display, anyway. And, uh, the twin commentaries, as you claim to be, asked of the old doc, because you know the doc knows. And, uh, one of those questions was, what sound does a hippopotamus make when you pick its nose? And I know the answer to that question. You might not know that the old doc knows this, but I myself have, um, have picked the nose of a, uh, of a hippo out on the safari. And, uh, I'll tell you what sound it makes, but it depends. You must answer this qualifying question. So, to answer the qualifying question, you need to reply back to me is this A, a male hippo, or B, a um, female hippo? The second part of the question, the, uh, the qualifier, is, uh, you know, it depends what you're sticking in there. If you're sticking your finger in there, it's going to make one sound. You stick something else in there, as I tried, it will make a totally different sound. It's amazing. It depends what you're sticking in that nose. I'll tell you what, man, it's deep. They got a deep nose hole. I got about 15 inches in that thing. But uh, it made one heck of a sound. I can imitate it. But again, are we talking males or females? I know a lot of people have made their picks on who they feel is going to win the Super Bowl in uh, 2008, 2007 season, 2008, and uh, I am uh, being a Chicago educated individual, I've got to say, go Bears, yeah, i got to say go Bears, um, go Cubs while the season's still going, hopefully we can get something done there, Cubbies and uh, go Bears in the rest of the season and uh, we'll be rooting for you. I'll tell you that right now. The Dr. R Show is a huge supporter of these Chicago Bears. Well that's about it for the, the old Dr. R Show this time and uh, thanks for viewing, thanks for clicking, thanks for subscribing, thanks for being my friend, thanks for for licking in, thanks for for supporting the Chicago Bears and the Everyone else that looks at us, and uh, um, we'll see you next time. I'm losing my mind here from the Dr. Art Show. Yeah! The Dr. Art Show, sponsored in part by Hilton's Oyster Stew, ready to serve.